everybody, it's me, Glitchy Gameplays, and we're back in another episode of Valheim. Yeah, it was episode five? No, episode four. It was episode four. What am I thinking? Um, but we're back, and uh, obviously we have some things we need to do today. Um, we, uh, first off, um, a few of our boar, they have grown up. Um, we've got, I think, five now? Yeah, we got five of them. One little baby one, and four adults. So pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, but the one thing I want to do today, because now that we can, I want to go to the Black Forest and I want to get some some copper, some tin, and craft up some bronze. Um, that also means we're going to have to go into a few dungeons as well. So we do know of one dungeon, um, if I can remember where it's at, all the way over here. So there is that dungeon, um, but there is this Black Forest up here. So... I'm thinking, I mean, either one we could go to, we could probably go to this dungeon first, um, because we need to get, uh, the cores first. I forgot exactly what they're called. They're like something core or whatever. So we might go hit that dungeon up first. Um, I also want to make a bow. Now, the only thing is you need eight leather scraps. We only have five. Uh, if I'm correct. Yes, we need eight leather scraps. We only have five. But, you know, I don't know if I want to kill my boars. <laughs> Not yet, at least. Um, and I think what I'm, I think what I'll do is I'm going to, let me expand this. I think, I think it's, I think they're ready. Right? There we go. Expand it a little bit. That way they can separate and they'll start spawning more. Um, but we, we need to get three more leather scraps. And I want to let these guys breed up a little bit more. Um, so I think we're going to go out and just go try and find some boars. Uh, we don't really need to have leather scraps. We don't need to have the bow immediately, like right now. But I would like to have one soon. Um, so we'll keep that on us. Um, and then, yeah, we're going to go take on uh, a dungeon. So, yeah, cool. Let me eat my food. And then we have to head off in what direction? direction or south okay so heading basically back towards ike there almost cool so let's go do that we'll start heading that way and uh oh what is it getting dark hmm if it starts getting dark we'll, we'll make like a little uh shelter basically but yeah we're gonna head back um along the way we're going to try and take on, uh, take out some uh, boars and deer. Um, that way we can collect a little bit more mushrooms. Yeah, because then we can actually start upgrading our stuff. And we're going to need a lot of just deer leather and boar leather scraps for uh, future future stuff. It's a one star. There's a one star deer right there. We need to be very quiet. Come on. Don't get spooked. Don't get spooked. Hiya! Yes! Hooray. That definitely helps. How, how much did we get from that? We got oh, only two? Dang. I've gotten. I've gotten more from those guys before, but okay. They've got a deer and a boar right here. Well, six hit. Nice. Gimme, give gimme. Give gimme, gimme. So I got four. See, we got two, le two uh, leather from that guy too. And I don't need to sneak up on this guy. Oh, yeah. Cool. Getting more stuff. Um, still only a six. You guys, so annoying. Although mushrooms, give me, give me. We have collected a lot of mushrooms, raspberries, I and mean, you could tell, like we've we've gone through and collected a bunch of it. We're gonna keep collecting it because we're gonna need. I mean, it's good to have a massive supply of that stuff. That way, later on, we don't have to go collecting for it. We might as well collect it and 
mark it down now and won't have to deal with it later. That's a good idea. <gasps> a boar. It is a boar. Gimme, 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 gimme. Come on. I mean, honestly, I'm kind of... Part of me is kind of happy we have a river here. Because that'll get us to level up our... Uh, our swimming. There we go. Because we're going to have to cross it a lot just to get over here. So, levels up our, our swimming and whatnot. Now we need one... One more boar, and then we can uh, make ourselves the crude bow. I've, I really, I need to get the crude bow. I also need to chop down trees and start collecting uh, feathers for arrows. Because right now, I think I have a couple feathers, but, and I do have a few arrows. So honestly, I guess I could use those and go kill um, some burbs. Some good old burbs. That might be a... Good idea. Did I just spook a deer? I think I did. Yep, I just saw him run away. Okay, that's fine. Once we get a bow, the deer will be a lot easier. Hey, the last boar. Come here. Ah! Yes. That. Yay, we've got eight, and we have a little shelter here. I'm gonna go sleep. Uh, I might need to collect some, some wood. Come on. And some stone, because I need to actually make a uh, campfire. Oh, wait, I do have pickaxes. I can actually break stones now. I forgot about that. Uh, yeah. Pick on these. Level one pickaxe. Pickaxe. Pickaxe? Yes, pickaxe. Totally. There we go. Oh no. Tis but a gray dwarf. Aha! No match for my strength now. Hmm. All right, let's get a roof over this place. Uh, clear that out of the way. There we go. Get this out. We need to make a workbench. And this will just be just a little, like, mini shelter. Just for now. Nothing too special. Oh, stamina. Come on. There we go. That should be all that. Okay. I think it's the shallow roof. Yes. I think... Oh, I need more wood. Ah! Um... That really hurt. <laughs> oh, that took out like half of my health. That was so rude. Yeah, uh, tip, watch out for falling trees. They hurt really bad. There we go. Let's not, let's not have that happen again. <laughs> grab that. Cool, and then should be the rest of what we needed, right? I think. Okay, 
and then this one. Hey, look at that. And then we can not add furniture because we don't have enough wood again. Ah, yes. We have slept. It is now morning. Hooray. Repair all our stuff too. And I could actually make... Oh, no. Why is it storming? This makes everything just worse. <laughs> Why? Uh, okay. We can make the bow. I might as well do it now. Since we're here. Give me that wood. Did that be enough? Yes, it did. Cool. Prepare. Screwed bow. Bam. Um, a lot of useless stuff. You know what? I'm going to make a chest. I'm going to place that here, and we'll just use that as like a... Oh, oops. We'll use that as a, uh, I don't know, a, a storage thing just for here. Once we get an actual cart, though, that'll make things a lot easier. Carts make this game just a little bit easier. Uh, let's see. Let's grab... Choke. How do I not... Come on! I'm trying to make this quick. You're ruining my video. Stupid game. I have 10. I have exactly 10 now. Going back and forth, back and forth. Just like, just give me what I want. There we go. I have the arrows on me. I didn't even realize that. Cool. That makes things a lot easier. Just having that on me. Okay. All right. Let's go to the the dungeon. To the dungeon. Grab all our stuff. What up, Skelly boys? Um. I thought there was a. Du ah! There it is. I'm surprised there's no uh, skeletons. They usually would have spawned back unless they're chasing something. Which is. Oh, I hear him. Where you at? I heard you. I heard you. Ooh, there you are. Yeah. Oh, hello. Yeah. Get out of here. All right. Let's head on in. Away from the rain. Oh, that is not... There we go. Yes, the yellow mushrooms. Yellow mushrooms are really good. Okay, quite a few of those. Door number one. Hello. Housekeeping. Hello. Oh, dead end. Okay. Well, that's a shame. Hello. Oh, number two. Ooh! Hello. Scared me. Oh, I should have brought a club. What am I doing? Ooh! <laughs> what am I doing? Why did I not bring a club? Why did... What? Wood. I need wood. I'm dumb. Why did I not do that? You probably are all like screaming at me right now, like, what? Glitchy, what are you doing? What are you doing? You need to use a club. You fool. It's not gonna be upgraded or anything, but we'll use that. Right, that should do more damage. 12, it's 25, we'll see, we'll see. It should do more damage. 
Right? Maybe. I also need to eat a little bit more. You guys still here? Yes, you are. There we go. I will say, wait, that torch, honestly, like... Ow! Ooh! Yeah, club, no work. Club, no work. Club, not work. Cool, we're using axe. That work. Axe work. Right. I hope you guys can see. I mean, I need my shield. I can't do this without my shield. Nothing. <gasps> it's one of the cores. Yes. Sirtling core. That's what it is. Nope. Nothing. No? Oh. Anything? Bones! Can I, if we collect enough bones and skeleton trophies, we could make the uh, skeleton shield. That is, that is a very nice shield. For beginning, at least. Hello, skelly boys. Out of here! Oh, ow! Stop with your your rudeness. Is that a ghost right here? Or is that just spooky dungeon noises? <laughs> I don't feel good about this. I do not feel good about this. <laughs> that is a one star. No. Uh-uh. Um. Get. Get trapped behind the door. Ooh, door broke. Door broke. Door bed. Bed door broke. Oh, no. I'm gonna fail. No, I got this. I got this. It's easy, easy, uh, like, Soulsborne, you know, mechanics, right? There we go. Ow! Got a man, stop it. Archer boy. That's his name. <gasps> break it, break it, break it. <gasps> no, no! Ooh! Aha, you broke it. That's your fault. You rancid remains. Ah! I missed it. Oh my gosh. I didn't think I'd run into this guy here. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. I don't like this guy. This guy is very bad. Very bad. <laughs> Just swing, swing. Trading blows. Ooh, that hurt. And I'm poisoned. Or, well, was for a second. No, I am poisoned. Now it's gone. Some more certain cores. Yeah, yeah. Yeah! Oh my gosh, there's so many in here. Some gold. A chest. Oh. With feathers. Nice. Awesome. A uh, ruby. Uh, we got seven. I need at least ten? Cause that way, then I can make a uh, furnace and a charcoal kiln. Oh my gosh! <laughs> bad! Bad! Very bad! Why? 
Who had the great idea of making this one? Ooh. Oh, I parried him. Okay. Ow, that really hurt. Oh no. I'm I have been the poisoned. This is not fun at all. Yes. Oh, we did it. All right, cool. Woo. There's a ghost behind that door. I don't like that. What was it? What? Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Lots of treasure in here. Cool. Or amber pearls. Anything else? Okay. Alright, ghosty boy. What you want, ghosty boy? Hello? Pushed him out of the way, I guess. Oh, yeah, you got... Oh, no. <laughs> Run! <laughs> I have nothing to heal. <laughs> nothing to heal myself with. I gotta just wait. Hello? See, it sucks, because these guys, you can't... Oh! Ooh! Ooh! Yeah, you can't tell when they hit. You can't tell when they're, like, swinging at you. They just... It's just... Ah! I don't know what to do. I'll have to sit here and just wait till we heal up a little bit more. I mean, I guess I could... Oh, no, he's gonna start breaking the door down. He broke the door down! He broke the door down! You just gonna stand there? All right, cool. That's fine. I'm I'm okay with that. You you're just gonna stand there, just take it. Cool. <gasps> the last and final certainly core. Hip hip hooray! Right? That was ten. Ten. Yay! I d I want to get more, but like ten is definitely a good number to start with. Right. And that was everything. Cool. Well, we completed our first dungeon. Look at that, everybody. We're great. We're fan freaking tastic. And it's sunny outside. Look at this. This is gorgeous. Um, we don't need more resin. Uh, well, we have the circling cores that we need. I'm thinking, do we decide to head back home and go to the Black Forest near our house? That way we can at least drop some stuff off. We're not having to carry all our stuff back. Hello, skelly mans. We'll take on this little uh, tower first. Aha! Cool. I need a sword. No, I need a mace. Um, for these guys, I need a mace. Because they don't deal with bludgeoning very well. So, that's definitely a good idea. There's no chest up there. Mm. Hey, we've got copper right here. A good old copper deposit. Cool. Anything else that's around? Maybe we could pick some blueberries? Perhaps. Oh, another copper deposit. That's good to know. There's two right next to each other. One star gray dwarf. And another one behind him. Ow. Stop it. 
nice. Oh, and we should be able to actually make uh, portals soon. Now that I think about it, because now we have uh, Greydorf Eyes, and once we get a Bronze Axe, we should be able to make a... Uh, or get. Uh, we should be able to uh, get... Oh my gosh, I'm blanking out what it's called. Uh, fine wood for the birch trees. You should be able to cut those guys down now. Nice. Another copper deposit here. Wait, did I... How did I spell that? <laughs> Copper. Yes, that's... Yes. Um, oh, also, I want to click on that dungeon. Exit off. That way we know, okay, that one's been cleared. Because they don't respawn. Um, the, the, like, they don't... They don't change, they don't respawn, uh, the items don't come back, uh, so I just X them off, and now I don't need to worry about it. And there is a, there is boar right here. Drop our stone and our resin. There we go. Uh, I'll drop the wood too, because grab that boar meat. Awesome. Yay. And then this is the river that actually connects up to... If we look here... Yeah, this river goes all the way down and connects up to where uh, we live. It's right here. Yeah, we live right here. So, that's kind of cool. If we wanted to, we could get a boat and use this river. I may need to widen it out just a little bit, make it a little bit safer for us. But, I don't know, that could be a good idea. Let's, uh, let's head back home now. Okay, so, We've kind of got a clearer view of the side of this mountain. And yeah, I don't I don't see an ice cave. Unfortunately. Now, there could be one like way up there or on the other side of the mountain, but as far as I can tell, it doesn't look like there's one on this side. But hey, while we're exploring, we can we can definitely check it out and see if we can find one from down here. Well, I think that was another uh boar. Little piggy. Yeah, because wait, we got one. One, two, three, four, five, and then there's a little baby one right there. We got six. Awesome. Keep it going, guys. <laughs> Good job. Good work. We're finally back home. We'll drop off a bunch of stuff. Get some sleep. Well, yeah, get some sleep first. And then we'll do it. But I will say we now need to make a an area for us to smelt down all our items and uh, making charcoal, all that kind of stuff. So I need to figure out how I want to do that and where I want to do it. Because these little pads are kind of all full. I do have this down here, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. Hmm. Cause I kind I kind of need to make that furnace so I can actually smelt everything. So, all right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna raise the ground up around here. Not only is that gonna help us with like protection, but this will give us enough space to build a uh, small forge area. I'm just going to do this. And all the way around. Oh, and I'm out of stone. That's great. I should be able to flatten most of it. X 
Because the other thing, too, is we can't... We can't exactly put... Um, a furnace and stuff on, like, wood. So we can't put it like, a raised platform or anything. It has to be on the ground or stone. Um, so right now, we're going to have to just raise the ground and do it this way. But I do need to go mining. Grabbing some more stone because... I don't have any more. So we're going to have to go do that. Now, what we could do... Is we could pause on making the, uh... What, what am I what am I thinking we could pause on on making the little forage area we could go get the uh, copper and tin right now and that'll give us a lot of stone so I'm thinking we go let's go do that instead yeah so let's let's make our way over towards the black forest then we can get a lot more stone and we can actually do some more terraforming and Messing with the area, making it look a little bit better, and giving us more space and protection, um, just to make our place a little bit better. All right, so here we are, Black Forest. I know we were in a Black Forest earlier, but this is this is one over by our house. Ooh, we got copper right here. Pretty handy. Uh, we will need to keep an eye out for trolls. Um, one thing I'm worried about in here is trolls and Great Dwarf Brutes, but I don't know, those, those aren't, well, I, I say they're, they're not, uh, like common, but honestly, they kind of are. More mushrooms. Got thistle. This is one that we really need to mark down because that's going to be used for... Oh, no. I didn't mean to get rid of the mushroom. And then... Thistle. Awesome. Any blueberries? I would love me some blueberries. Could grab us some core wood, too. Possibly. <gasps> carrots! More carrots and blueberries! Give it, give it. There we go. Ah, great Orphanest as well. We could mark that off. I don't want to destroy that. Um, so that, that, that thing over there, little purpley black smoke, that is a Grey Dwarf Nest. In the dungeon over here. Um, but the Grey Dwarf Nest, what that does is it spawns Grey Dwarfs. Um, so it can be quite handy in turning it into a like a spawner and using it to collect wood, stone, and resin. Oh, I thought it was going to parry him. It didn't work. Well, I need to... Let me mark... The thistle down. There we go. We do have another dungeon. Another great dwarf nest over there too. Nice. And did I mark down? I did not mark down the blueberries. Um. Shoot, I don't remember where that was. Was it this? I think it was this. I'm going to say it was right here. Blueberry. Yeah, we'll say it was right there. I pro I'm probably wrong, but, you know, it's fine. We'll need to collect a bunch of that because I do end up wanting to making... I do end up want to making... I, I can't speak today. I want to make Queen's Jam. Um, because Queen's Jam is really good for stamina. Um, ah, blueberries. Yay. We'll mark this one correctly this time. 
this one's close enough to it. I don't I don't feel the need to mark that one. Oh, hello. Wow, well, there's a bunch of you guys. Ow! You're all bullying me. Get out of here. Oh yeah. Nice. Raiders aren't really a problem right now. Later on in the game, they'll literally be nothing compared to us. I, ha I had it uh, in the my series over on my main YouTube channel, and like, I had a... I don't remember what it was. I think it was a the black, the black steel or... Oh, black metal. It was the black metal um, sword, and just one-shotting them completely. It was so nice. We'll get to that point. It'll take a while, but we'll get to that point. <laughs> Like, I only say it'll take a while just because taking this series a little bit slower. But we'll definitely get there and we'll be able to one-shot a bunch of these guys. There's deer. Nope, I didn't tow it out fast enough. How? Yes! That's what I'm talking about, baby. There we go. Get that thistle. I totally said I was going to come out here and grab copper, and now I'm like halfway in the forest, freaking collecting uh, berries and mushrooms and thistle. Hey, I'm being productive still. I'm not just goofing off. It's fine, right? More blueberries. Oh, uh, yeah. Nope, totally missed. Grab these. Oops, nope. There we go. Thistle. Is he still over here? Oh, I see ya. Think I could get him from here? Oh, look at that! That was nice. That was a once-in-a-lifetime shot. Never gonna be able to do it again. <gasps> Lots of blueberries. Uh, that is a brute. I need to... Spell, quickly! Ow! <laughs> I saw a brute. No. Be gone. Flee! Uh-uh. Go away. I want nothing to do with you. I am looking for copper now. I am going back to what I was doing. I feel like they are here to remind me that I am not doing what I was supposed to be doing. Go find where that copper was. What? Oh, hello. And then you start running. As soon as I notice you, that's when you start running. I missed. That would have been a cool shot, though. That would have been awesome. Do you have. Oh, that is the little copper that I found earlier. Okay. There we go. Nice. We've got some space. Yeah. Cool. Well, I'm going to show you guys how uh, I break down these uh, copper deposits. Once I clear the area around it just a little bit. Uh, but basically what you want to do is you can you can go in and like just start mining it from the top down. But it gets a little time consuming and a lot of times you don't get everything so um, the way you do it 
is you dig a trench that spans all the way around the copper deposit. Dig the trench all the way down as far as you can go. And then uh, start digging out from the bottom up. Um, when you basically dig out all, the entire bottom of the deposit, it will then uh, collapse and fall and break down into uh, all the copper ore and stone that it has inside of it. And so you're not, you're like basically putting that time down to half and you're getting everything from this. Um, now, luckily, what it looks like, we don't have a large stone connected to this one because there is these copper deposits and there's like large boulders that can, that are sometimes can connect to them. That gets annoying because then that just makes it even more time consuming. Um, but this, this should be easy. Mark down this mushroom as well. Okay. So let's get onto that. Now this is, this is where having a cart would be amazing because then I can just mine this out and then, uh, put it in the cart, take it back home and then come back. I could carry a lot more stuff with it because right now I'm not going to carry as much of anything. Which digs straight down. This isn't like Minecraft where like, oh no, I'm going to fall into a lava pit. Or, oh, I'm going to fall into a cave system that goes like thousands of blocks down. Nope. There's nothing down here except more and more dirt. And you'll actually won't be able to, you won't be able to dig too far. I'm almost there. think yeah that's it right there so now we just mine all the way around this bad boy and honestly if you're able to like basically the way it works is that you don't want the copper deposit touching anything once it's not touching anything it will fall but if it is if it's not touching anything and it's not collapsing then you'll want to start digging out the bottom of it because there's there's some most of the time there's like a glitch where it'll be like oh there's like a tiny piece of this deposit that is still touching the ground so you got to mine the bottom of it and then it'll fall so now it does suck that this is on the side of a mountain because it makes breaking this down a lot more i don't know irritating <laughs> but i think i'm gonna sit here and i'm gonna mine around this and then i will i'll catch you guys when anything happens uh, i'm probably not gonna be able to mine out this entire thing yet um, i'll probably have to go head over back home and drop some stuff off um, so i'll probably cut back to that unless i get i don't know attacked by like a troll or great orcs or something i don't know but I'll see you guys here in a little bit. All right. So I have now mined out a trench that goes all the way around this thing. Um, and then at this point, that's where you just start digging all of the dirt out from under it. Again, this is still going to take a while because, I mean, as you can see, it's still connecting. And I can't dig any more under it. So I have to basically dig through most of it. Um, but this will cut that half that that half that time down in half and um it's gonna take it's gonna you're gonna get a lot more out of it um a lot more copper out of it so i definitely recommend doing this once i yeah, so i'm probably gonna just sit here mining out all the, all under this um getting as much as dirt out of here and then Digging through this. The thing too is, so digging through the dirt, it's like one smack and it's gone. One smack, gone. One smack, gone. And that one is broke. And then if you take your axe and you start going through this, That was 12 hits. <laughs> that 
that right there was 12 hits. So, if you really want to dig from the top down, yeah, sure, go for it. It's going to take you forever. Um, unless you have a higher grade pickaxe, but you're not going to get a higher grade pickaxe unless you get copper. Unless you have found a way to go mine iron or go get iron this early on which i guess you i guess you can maybe i don't know but i'm gonna sit here dig through some of this and uh, i will see you guys here in a moment what the what a, how i'm confuzzled a boar has escaped and I don't know how maybe I do know how <laughs> um, hold on I'm gonna try something I need where is it at Crafting? yes mm. eh. better maybe whoa okay this one def definitely needs to be replaced sorry like i came back to like drop some stuff off and fix up my stuff and came back and i saw there was a boar who had escaped <laughs> so at least we fixed that i don't know i don't know where it's gone it's gone that's fine Give them all the loves. What the? No. There we go. All the pets. And then... Oh, you guys only have one raspberry left. Let me go get you guys some more. Grab some from inside. And... Sure, that should work. Um, I'll drop these off. But I think what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to end the episode off here. Um, because I'm still mining that copper. <laughs> and granted, I haven't really gotten too far into it. I built the trench and then dug a little bit into it and then stopped. Um, but we did go into a dungeon. We did explore the Black Forest just a little bit and gathered up some thistles, some blueberries, we did get a little bit of copper, um, which was kind of cool. So uh, I think next episode we'll kind of focus more on mining, which more or less you're just going to see me mine the last little bit of the copper, um, get some tin, and then we'll figure out a way to bring it all the way back here and then probably build the forge and get all that stuff smelted. Um, that way we can move on and get some more cool stuff. But like I said, I'm going to leave it off here. I hope you guys enjoyed if you did, leave a like and subscribe. Again, don't forget to go check out my main channel um, over at Glitchy Gameplays. Um, it is linked down in my description, uh, as well as my Twitch, which is also... Actually, I don't think I have my Twitch linked down in the description, but it is just Glitchy Gameplays. It should be linked on my main channel. Um, I'll make sure to put, in, put it in the description of this video. Um, but go check that out. I also have a playlist for this series if you want to check that out as well, if you missed any other episodes. Um, let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see. And like I said, I will catch you all in the next one. And, uh, oh, goal for this video, 100 likes. Um, I, we haven't reached 100 likes in the other video yet, but I want to see. Can you guys hit 200 likes on this video as well? All right. Bye-bye.